Hey everyone, hope that you're having a beautiful day. I must be ambitious today for a Monday because I'm coming on and I wanted to show you guys something that I'm taking a mediumship course right now. So with this lady, um, Caramel Joy Baird, and uh, she was on My Mom's a Medium. And uh, she's a really, really, really awesome lady. She gives lots of um, guidance. And so one of the things that she, hi, Bonnie, hope that you're having an awesome day. Um, let me know if you've ever watched, uh, Caramel, Carmel, however you say her name, on, uh, My Mom's a Medium. She's really, really cool, and she's from Edmonton. Anyway, so one thing that she taught us to do is, especially when it comes to your business, but, I mean, you can do this with anything, is to create, like, a little vision board. Um, because I do find when you do, never saw her. Okay, well, you should definitely check her out. She's awesome. Um, and I'm really enjoying her course because one of the things that you can do is kind of like similar to what I'm creating is you can, you can purchase programs like digital programs, and then you can just watch whenever the heck you feel like it. Um, but then we also do like webinars and we get together live, which is cool. So yeah. Anyway, so what, what she has taught us is to, um, kind of create a vision board for your business or for again for it could be weight loss or whatever it is but I find this really great for intuitives as well so like for me what I did was today is the 21st so like I just bought this from the dollar store and I've already gone through an, an entire vision board already for myself and I've attracted literally everything on the board for my business so this one I've decided to do just like for my like personal business just like my whole life and I'm starting to realize that my business is my whole life because it's it's my purpose right and I had this conversation with somebody recently actually yesterday where um this person is really struggling with um like what they feel like they're here to do and feel free to share if that's you if you feel like sometimes you're struggling with like what is my purpose am I really following my path and I said that the things that I'm doing aren't really like, it's not really like a, I shouldn't say it's not really like a business for me as much as it is. It's, it's what I do day in and day out. It's what I breathe. So I figured, well, why would you not charge? So that's kind of like for, for me, um, my lifestyle, my purpose is all kind of entangled. So that's why I chose to kind of do mine this way. So basically... I just wrote this intuitively, okay? So it's kind of cool, but I wrote down school, business, because right now I'm taking um, mediumship. I am taking, I'm behind in some some of my coaching classes. Um, I'm doing my 300-hour yoga, yogurt. Oh my gosh, I keep saying yogurt, weird. Yoga teacher training, so I can teach uh, other people how to do their 200 level, which is amazing. And um, I'm also in Sean Leonard's uh, Spirit Tribe, where we learn all about psychic and mediumship work as well. And I feel like I'm in other programs as well. Um, I'm just like doing my best to kind of think. So school is like all of these programs. Um, business, again, is just related to, of course, my, my programs that I'm teaching. Food has come up here and medicines, which is interesting because that's been a big theme for me as I'm working on uh, products and I'm also like learning about healing through food and um, having a lot of breakthroughs with digestive health and things like that. So I really think right now it's important for us to not deprive ourselves of anything. So again, when you if you go and choose to do something along the lines of this, um, really listen to what your intuition is getting you to write because I never know what's going to happen when I do this. So on the 21st, I get Sherry. That's my um, person that's helping me with my website. So I'm going to get everything out for her and then um, to work on, on my YouTube channel as well because I'm getting the hang of just um, making tags because I often won't even take the time to put a tag in, in the YouTube and then social, which of course is doing stuff like this, coming on or just chatting with more people and, um, you know, not hiding. And then I have gardening flowers because I'm really feeling that importance of, of grounding and going inwards because I'm starting to um, create a lot of programs, retreats, things like that. And I know that if I don't take my own retreats, take my own time, 
then I'm not really able to understand and help others. And then I have Trek, Walk, Explore, Wednesday again. What's really cool is you don't know how it's going to happen or when it's going to happen, but it certainly does when you put it out there. So anyway, these are just things, flower essences, my labels, focus, work, meditation workshop. That's something I'm going to be creating. I'm getting my eyelashes. I have a um, physio appointment for my neck. Uh, apparently I'm supposed I'm going away back to Nova Scotia to have a vacation and I wrote down fried food who does that anyway that's what came up fried food and I think it's just because it's about pleasure um, and then I'm going to because I'm doing the yoga training on my own time I'm going to be creating um, like my I'm, I, it's the same type of program you have to kind of do it on your own right motivate yourself so these are things that I'm just recommending if you are a person who needs to motivate yourself or needs motivation these are just recommendations so yeah my yoga training that's how I've decided I'm gonna do it fried foods again on there for the weekend which is hilarious I start my Akashic Records program July 5th so if you're interested um I have a massage, so this is kind of me starting to schedule in my self-care. Um, something was telling me to write free information sessions, have meetings with people um, for that week to to explain some of the programs and, and stuff that I'm doing. I have an eye exam. Um, also, my Akashic Records students. Uh, business practices, entrepreneurial support. I think I'm really going to start working a bit more on um, helping other people with their with their businesses and and again motivating them to to follow their purpose um so these are the things that have just popped up for me but I would love to see if you guys do one of these what it looks like because it's really really cool and I just felt like sharing all right love you all bye for now